Guys, it's been a crazy road so far. We've lost some absolute crazy characters. Some characters we really love, some characters we absolutely despise. The show has a way of one up in itself. Grow attached to no one, man, because this right. show will rip them right from your hands and murder them off in the most horrific way. But we are starting a new season today, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in for real, for real. So, guys, we are getting so close to finishing this, which is really sad because I know when that day comes, I'm going to have that like three week pit in my stomach of just missing the show. But, anyways, here we go, starting a new season. Let's go. Let's go. We'll see, if, we'll see if there's different stuff. What do you think? Season six, baby. Let's go. I'm so excited. This is the this has been the highlight of my 2024, I think. Well, watching this show. Yeah, it's been great. <clears throat> You know, I don't really disagree with you, to be honest. I'm just so excited to start a new season because every season has been really different. Well, I heard that six is like arguably one of the best ones. I mean, everyone says that about everyone, you know? Yeah, but they I've say that six. about every episode. But no, I've seen six like uh, as a constant one. Guys, you have to let us know in the comments. Let the debate be settled. Which season is the best? And if you see a season that has a lot of likes on it, go ahead and like that one too. So that way we can know what the masses think. Because we're going to tell you at the end which one we think is the best. Yeah, we'll, we'll do our best to write all that stuff out. So at the end of this series, we can really try to go over everything, all those thoughts. And if I had to pick on the spot right now, I would say four is my favorite. So far. I think my favorite season, I think my favorite season is going to be this one right here. <laughs> so no, nothing different, right? Not yet. Nothing different has happened yet. So I guess maybe not. Wait, if they introduce it in this show, then they'll show it? I don't know. See. Sometimes they do that, so we have the element of like, what is that the whole time? You're no longer me, brothers. Oh my god, they just <clears throat> left him like that. Yeah, absolutely, they did. Oh no, is that ghost? I do feel like in hindsight, the two bees death, like the Rob Stark death, that one definitely kind of made me a little more stone faced for this one though. Oh, he didn't know. I think Davos is one of my favorite characters. Just saying. Yeah, he gives me like really calming vibes. Yes. So I guess the new <clears throat> main guy at the wall is going to be Sir Davos now, the yeah. Onion Knight. <laughs> I don't know where he got that idea. He's just there because Stannis sent him. <laughs> well, Stannis is dead. He don't know that yet, I don't think. He'll find out. He's about to turn into a White Walker, isn't he? I shoved some dragon glass up his butt. <laughs> Thorne did this. Yeah, he did. How many of your brothers do you think you can trust? We need all the help we can get. <laughs> oh, no. Your worst enemy. She's gonna be like, perhaps we can burn the body. I'm very familiar with the procedure. Oh yeah, she low-key flashed John. We'll never forget that. I saw him in the flames, fighting at Winterfell. Yeah, didn't you see Stannis in the flames? Don't speak for the flames. Yeah, oh, your flames are, but he's gone. you know. Man, Sir Alistair, you suck, man. I feel like he's next to get stabbed, though. Jon Snow is dead. Who killed him? I did. The other officers in this castle. Murderer! Traitor! Right, he was loaded. You're right! We've committed treason, all of us. Jon Snow was my Lord Commander. I had no love for him. That was no secret. But I never once disobeyed an order. Loyalty is the foundation on which the Night's Watch is built. And the Watch means everything to me. I have given my life. We have all given our lives to the Night's Watch. So did John. Jon Snow was going to destroy the Night's Watch. He let the wildlings through our gates as no Lord Commander has ever done before. He gave them the very land on which they reaved. I do see their side though. Yeah, I, I mean. Lord Commander Snow hmm. did what he thought was right. I have no doubt about that. And what he thought was right would have been the end of us. He thrust a terrible choice upon us and we made it. He should have took him to hard home, then he wouldn't be saying all this, right? Yeah. <laughs> he would have a different perspective. He'll have seen we didn't come. Thorne will have made it official by now. Castle Black is his. I don't care who sits at the high table. John was my friend. Those fuckers butchered him. Now we return the favor. We don't have the numbers. We have a dire wolf. It's not enough. I didn't know Lord Commander Snow for long. But I have to believe he wouldn't have wanted his friends to die for nothing. We all die today. I say we do our best. Man, I really need some friends like that. We, go. we need right. to fight, but we don't need to die. Not if we have help. You're not the only ones who owe your lives to Jon Snow. I'll be back as soon as I can. What, the wildlings? He's gonna go ask them? Right, and this is crazy though, because this is gonna cost like a civil war at the wall. <clears throat> they really don't have time for this. Oh, here goes these filet people. The first time I saw her, the kennel master's daughter. 
Oh, side piece died. Yikes. She smelled of dog. I wasn't much older, but everybody was already afraid of me. You certainly were. What could I do to her that those hounds couldn't? She was fearless. There was nothing she wouldn't do. Your pain will be paid for a thousand times over. I believe him. I wish you could be here to watch. <laughs> I believe him. <laughs> Shall I have a grave dug for her, my lord? Or would you rather the men build a pyre? Is he for real about to cry? Buried, burned. This is good meat. Feed it to the hounds. Oh. He's crazy. <laughs> Thanks to you, the false king Stannis Baratheon is dead. Do you know who struck the killing blow? No. A shame. I'd reward the man. A great victory. Do you feel like a victor? I rebelled against the crown to arrange your marriage to Sansa Stark. Right, that was just level one, bro. No. A reckoning will come. We need the North to face it. The entire North. They won't back us without Sansa Stark. Don't they have a weird relationship? We no yeah. longer have Sansa Stark. You played your games with her. You played your games with the heir to the Iron Islands, and now they're both gone. Oh, they escaped. Men after them. Without Sansa, you won't be able to produce an heir. And without an heir, let's hope the Maesters are right and Lady Walder's carrying a boy. Mmm, uh, boy. I can't believe Theon actually escaped. That's crazy. At that point, he didn't have a choice because he felt like once that girl died, he just knew it was going to happen. Well, they didn't have video cameras. Yeah, but even if he told the truth, Ramsey would still torture him until he figured out that he was telling the truth. You I was know, just like, oh, she died. Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. oh, my God. It's the only way to throw off the hound. Being what his hounds do to a person, this way is better. Mm. Please make it, you guys. Please. What are they going to do? I don't know. They have nowhere to go. Because they can't make it. Oh, my gosh. I want to cry right now. Oh, my gosh. Oh, man. I'll know them away. No, no, no. Don't do that. No. You will go north. No, bro. John is Lord Commander of the Castle Black. Oh, no. John ain't got no friends at Castle Black. Right now. This is crazy. I know. This is some damn good writing right here. No, Leon. Don't you dare. Brother, 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 brother. No. Oh, they're going to beat you purple, brother. Oh, my goodness. Where is Lady Bolt? Who's that? We don't know her. I left her to die in the snow. Those are like his roommates, though. He can, like, steer them. They found her immediately. Oh my God! What are they gonna do? How the heck did they cross the river? They had a little bridge over there. Oh my God. I can't wait to see what part Ramsey cuts off you this time. Oh my God! Who? Who? Brienne, maybe? Because Brienne killed yeah, Stannis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes! Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go! Oh hey, Podrick. <laughs> you better run, brother. <laughs> yes, let's go. Okay. Brienne. No shot, she takes out the whole- Oh, okay. Oh, oh man, shit. maybe. Maybe not. Oh, no. That's why Vladimir Bolton made that comment about they want to meet this person. Yeah. Oh, he's been training. Yeah, twice a day, right? Yep, with Brienne. Please stay with, the, with them, Sansa. <laughs> Theon, grab the sword. Sansa won the damn lottery, didn't she? Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. Yes. <clears throat> Thank you, Theon. I still don't like you, Theon, but you know what I'm saying. I like Theon. He helped Sansa escape. He yeah. got redemption from in my book. Well, he's still he's still got a lot to do for sure. He did some pretty horrific things. Yeah, he did. That was insane, guys. Let's go. I love that. She's like, I made a vow to your mother. Lady Sansa, I offer my services once again. Please accept this time. I will shield Please. your back and keep your counsel and give my life for yours if need be. I swear it by the old gods and the new. And I vow that you shall always have a place by my hearth and... Meet and meet at my table. Meet <laughs> and meet at my table. They're just reciting <laughs> stuff. <laughs> I pledge to ask no service of you. You okay, baby? That girl? might bring you dishonor. Oh, you tough ground over here. Oh, Lord. I swear it by the old gods and the new. Arise. I just love that. I love that. That was good. One of the best moments of the series, for sure. That was great. Dorn? It'd be so cool to ride on a ship like that. I'm sorry to disturb you. A ship from Dawn has sailed into the harbor. Oh, she thinks Jamie did it. Holy crap, dude. I am so nervous for this. This is about to be rough. I feel like if this was a modern show, Cersei's definitely on pills and drinking wine. Like, she's that lady. That curse is coming true, ain't it? Do you remember the first time you saw a dead body? Mother. All I could think about when she died was what would happen to her now. Every day, every night. What does Mama look like now? 
as she started to bloat. I think about locking Marcella in a crypt. I think about her beautiful little face starting to collapse. Shh, don't think about it. I have to. It's not right. She has to suffer alone. She's not suffering. She's gone. No one can hurt her anymore. She was good. From her first breath, she was so sweet. I don't know where she came from. <laughs> That's so wild, dude. She was nothing like me. No meanness, no jealousy, just good. No, I knew this would happen. The witch told me years ago. Oh, so she really she believed three that. Children. She promised me they'd die and gold their shrouds. Everything she said came true. You couldn't have stopped it. You gotta protect Amon. It's prophecy. It's fake. You don't believe that. Of course I do. You told me yourself. When father died, you said we had to stay together. You said people would try to tear us apart, take what's ours. Fuck prophecy. Fuck fate. Fuck everyone who isn't us. We're the only ones who matter. The only ones in this world. And everything they've taken from us, we're going to take back and more. That is not the reaction I was expecting. I thought she was going to, like, flip out on him. I think at this point, like, she's just giving in to fate. You know what I'm saying? The, she's been marched through the streets. Prophecy. Yeah, the freaking the high sparrows taking over. She's thinking about, she's been in there, like, repenting and thinking about, like, the bigger meaning to everything and, like, just contemplating, like, reality on its deepest level. So she's definitely in her head. Yeah. They scream in agony and their shame is so great they do not feel the flames. I'd like to see my brother. Confess. Please. How is he? At least tell me that. Confess. I am the queen and I demand to see my brother. Sinners don't make demands. They make confessions. Our other guests need you. Except that Unella can be overzealous at times. You don't say. She is way nicer to her than Cersei, though. It isn't Sir Loras that brings me here. Your husband misses you dearly. The love between a man and wife is sacred. It reflects the love the gods have for all of us. But sin leads us away from the sacred. I have nothing to confess. So you believe you are pure, perfect, holy without sin. But you have many miles to go. So she just has to admit about her brother? Yeah, they're just trying to get, like, confessions out of people, though. I mean, you know, like, they know good and well they're guilty of, like, their so-called charges. You know, what if they were wrong? I would confess after, like, years and years and years in there. Like, hypothetically, I'd confess, you know what I'm saying? Fought men from every country. He experienced everything while I sat here in Dorne, trying my best to keep my people alive and well fed. We each have our roles. Oberyn was born to be an adventurer, and I was born to rule. The gods are not fools. He would have been a lousy adventurer. And Oberyn, he would have been a terrible ruler. Prince Dora. The princess Marsana. Oh, no. He's he about to be. <gasps> oh, man. No I kind of had the vibe that was going to happen, too. Oh, wow. So she's going to be in charge of Dorne now? <laughs> Yeah, she just coup, overthrew. Mm -hmm. the last time you left this palace, you don't know your own people. They're disgust for you. Oberyn Martel butchered, and you did nothing. You're not a Dornish man. Well, that was his fault, though. You're not our prince. My son, Tristan. Yeah, what are they going to do with him? Just like you. And weak men will never rule Dorne again. That's why we learned about that lady Nymeria ruling Dorne. Bro, things are heating up in this thing. It's all about to fall apart. Oh, no. Is that for Marcella? Oh, no, no, never mind. Is he in King's Landing? <clears throat> I told no, you no, no. I'm not hungry. We're not here to feed you. See. Si. We're here to kill you. What? Do you want her to do it? Or me? We are family. I don't want to hurt you. What? You. Good. Smart boy. Oh. Come on, bro. You got this. Oh, my gosh. They're just going to kill this little boy. He just lost his, like, intent. That was cheap. Oh, man. Oh, wow. You're a greedy bitch. You know that? <laughs> I didn't even get to feel bad because they're greedy. <laughs> but that's so crazy, though. Like, dang, give them a chance. They killed their own family, though. Like, jeez. We're dressed like common merchants. You walk like a rich person. That's how you walk. Time studying the way <laughs> but I'm not a rich person. <laughs> you walk as though the paving stones were your personal property. I used to steal from people like you when I was a boy. It's a good thing you're not a boy anymore. Always making jabs at him. Eoha, eh, eh, proza, proza. She thinks you want to eat her baby. See how Valeria could pay Gleis. Gloria out the pack on Jailas. Hitnira, always Rus. Why would she assume that, though? <laughs> it's a crazy world they live in. <laughs> That's a weird default assumption. Yeah, maybe so. <laughs> There's dragons flying around. Anything can happen. Misa means mother in Valerian. I know what Misa means. Who wrote it? Our queen is not as popular in Marine as she used to be. The sons of the harpy? Very possibly. Nash Targaryen took away the most valuable property. Told them human beings weren't even property to begin with. 
You can see why they're unhappy. Mm -hmm. Of course, it could also be the freedmen. She did fly away on a dragon and not come back. <laughs> True. Is she that, just MIA? Right, and that man is just in there street preaching. I know. Whoever you are, wherever you go, someone in this city wants to murder you. The sons of the Harpy planned their attack in the fighting pits very carefully, which means they take orders from someone. And have you started looking for that someone? My little birds have already taken wing. Oh no. I got the same look on my face that Tyrion does. I love how they go the opposite way. Right. They're the main characters. <laughs> What happened? I know. I won't be sailing to Westeros anytime soon. They burnt her fleet. Oh my goodness. Ooh, Maybe the, the sons of the harpy? Yeah, the same people who wrote that message. She's being sabotaged. Yeah, but we can't even find her. And they think that she's abandoned them, but she's just a little kidnapped right now. Or maybe she's, you know, making a new army. I think our friend got him. Don't know anything else that can melt a ram's horn. <laughs> True. We're on the right path then. Perhaps she's tired of being queen. I don't think she likes it very much. It's too smart to like it. Maybe she's flown somewhere else, somewhere far away from men like us. I've been all over the world. There's no escaping men like us. <laughs> There's no escaping her, eh? Keep coming back. Why? You know why. Isn't it frustrating, wanting someone who doesn't want you back? Of course it is. You're a romantic. I admire that. <sighs> I was spreading. Just cut it off. Oh, he got the grayscale. An army. A horde. That's crazy. Look how they beat the grass up. Did you see that circle out on? So they were, yeah, they yeah. were riding her down like crazy. Yes, he found it. That's a needle in a haystack for sure, but. They have her. And just what are they doing? I don't know, but it looks like there's a lot of slaves down there, right? With those things on their necks. Yeah. Oh, they captured her. Stop. <gasps> oh, you might pay for that. <laughs> Oh my gosh. That's a lot of people. I wonder who the new cow is. Well, they just said his name, but. Cow Moro. Yeah. I wonder, like, who he is. Is he gonna be nice? Eh, probably not. He'll <laughs> probably be a cow. She's like, I've already done this before. Why are y'all naming all these other good things? <laughs> Oh, she knew the language. Titles, titles. What if he's like so? <laughs> well, he better learn some respect before he becomes dragon food. <laughs> Basically, he said so. Ajala na shilok, ajber jovi na, ajber yandri shif. Ana obos usechi, me sherikron. So he honors that. Oh. Wow. No fact check or anything, though. She just, she just made it up. Oh, she's going to have to get killed? No, she's got to go to the retirement home. She gotta go live out her days with a bunch of widows. Boring. Gossiping about the good old days when they were gonna mount the world. <laughs> Boring. You don't want to live with a bunch of ladies, a bunch of widows. <laughs> Talking about the good old days, heck no. What are you up to? <gasps> Remember? Mm hmm. Is she gonna be like Bran, like disabled but like Worgen or something? I have no again? idea. Do you hear them talking? Ah, oh, that's that girl who be beating her up. <laughs> Stand and fight, blind girl. Dang. I can't see. Well, that's your problem, not mine. Oh my gosh, that girl be whooping her butt. Do they have like the police or something there? See you tomorrow. Wait, low key though, babe, that's why Kenny was trying to teach me both stuff. <laughs> so I could do that. So in this moment, you would prevail? She just said, I'll see you tomorrow. The whoop her butt. <laughs> Jesus. I would pick a different corner. <laughs> That's cool. Look, that mm. thing's in the background. Look, the first muskets. I don't know how I feel about the Night's Watch. They're all a bunch of stabbers, right? We right. have no cause to fight. We are both anointed knights. Yeah, that, lads. Nothing to fear. <laughs> I, will <grant> <laughs> I will allow you to travel south. A free man with a fresh horse. You can bring the Red Woman with you if you like. No thanks. You can keep her. Here with us, whichever you choose. But surrender 
By nightfall, all this ends with blood. We'll discuss amongst ourselves and come back to you with an answer. He handled that very well. I know, what the heck was that about? <laughs> In my learned opinion, we open that door and they'll slaughter us all. They want to come in. Ed is our only chance. It's a sad fucking statement if Dolores said is our only chance. <laughs> He's got this. the red woman? What's one redhead gonna do against 40 armed men? You haven't seen her do what I've seen her do. <laughs> He's seen her do a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. He's already a birth to that weird thing. <laughs> She gave birth to a freaking vape shop. <laughs> <laughs> the smoke monster on loss. Right. Why is this lady so freaky, babe? <laughs> like, she's just so sensual all the time. Like, Even by herself. <laughs> she's always just like... <laughs> because, would she be Melisandre if she wasn't? I don't know. <laughs> Whoa! Oh my god. Why does she look going? like that? <laughs> Oh my god, babe. It's like when you take off all that makeup and stuff. Just kidding, just kidding. Oh my gosh. So she's really, really old, huh? So she's an illusion. Yeah, like she puts on that front to make all the dudes want to sleep with her. Oh my god, that's what you're getting though? What I'm, what I think she's like, just knows, like she's like sent from somewhere. Cause she's very old and she has some magic behind her. It must feel more comfortable to sleep old. Huh, <laughs> what an unusual way to end it. This is exciting. I'm excited. I, know, I don't good. know where we're about to go. It's a bike. Is that good old three eye? Oh, they're just hanging out. Literally. <laughs> oh, we got to cut. Give him another go, Ned. 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 My father. That was like John, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, is that his sister? Yeah. Oh, so in all. Leanna. My there you go. I've seen her statue in the crypt. I kill him every night. <laughs> Would you get out of here? I thought he Sparring. disappeared. Yeah, you me too. Spar with when they're close off to the area. I don't know. What about him? Willis, come here. I was about to say. Hodor? It's like hot pie. <gasps> Is it Hodor? And you've got training. Sounds like a fair match to me. Benji always lifts his chin when he's about to charge. And lowers it when he's going to dodge my lady. <laughs> he's talking? Dogs. You leave the fight into the little lords, Willis. Come along now. It's no place for you. Ah, oh, Nan. Look at the size That's of old him. Nan. If he ever learned to fight, he'd be unstoppable. Well, he's never going to learn to fight because he's a stable boy. So leave him be. <sighs> oh, he felt happy there. Whoa. You finally show me something I care about, and then you drag me away. I wasn't drowning. I was home. Willis. Hold on. I saw you as a boy. You could talk. Hold on. Maybe he's got like a curse on him or something. Right. Right. Does Bran understand him? Or he just accepts that he says that? It's kind of like the when, way he says when it? Stewie talks to Lois and when Ash talks to Pikachu. Oh, they just get at each other, but yeah, like no one else it. does? Yeah. You shouldn't be here. It's not safe outside the cave. It's not safe anywhere. I saw that Hodor wasn't always Hodor. Hodor. His real name is Willis, and he could talk and fight and... What's wrong? She lost her brother. The Three-Eyed Raven says there's a war coming. And we're going to fight it in there. Brandon Stark needs you. And out there, he needs you. <laughs> she looks crazy as hell, don't she? <laughs> 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 you must have been thinking that too. <laughs> no, I thought she looked normal. She's just like a little first man out there. Yeah, she looks normal if you're like on another She's planet. She's like, hey, Brandon needs you. <laughs> no <laughs> accent or nothing. Time, Sir Davos. Open the door and the men inside can rejoin their brothers in peace. Direwolf food, let's get it. We'll even set the wolf free north of the wall where it belongs. Talk about capping. Nobody needs to die tonight. Never been much of a fighter. That's the sword. Apologies for what you're about to see. I'm so nervy. They might kill him right here just to put another freaking knife through our hearts. Nah, Onion Knight is not going down. He said, I got layers, baby. <laughs> layers on layers. It's a giant. Yes! Ed did it! Fight you, cowards! Oh no. Mm. Yeah, don't fight. Talk. 
That's why I don't get paid enough for this, son. You fucking traitor. No, you are, bro. The only bro. traitors here are the ones who shoved their knives into their Lord Commander's heart. Thousands of years, the Night's Watchers held Castle Black against the Wildlings. Until you. <laughs> Ollie's about it, though, ain't he? Yeah, he is. But that little boy seen <laughs> it, you know? Where they belong. I like Ed taking a position. I love it. Got some big shoes to fill, big dog. That was cool. Aw, for John. Of knives. I'll have my men get the wood for a fire. Bodies to burn. They'll sing songs of you. The great uniter who ended the war at the wall. So there she is. High and mighty Queen Cersei. No, they're working together. She looks my way. Gives me a little. See, guys. What John did, John helped break the propaganda. You know what I'm saying? So that's something that can never change. Like that's something that once that once that gets set, then that's gonna change things in the future. They both now have an understanding that they're just humans at the end of the mm. day. And that's something that'll always be there. Well, Hardhome helped with that because when they went and saw all that and they had to fight together, they seem like, you know. Like, Absolutely. Well. I've never been shy. I've never seen anything like it. I mean, That's the one who was mother. naked when Cersei was walking. Yeah. She didn't believe that. Yeah, yeah definitely not in that moment this. either. Mm. Is that Sir Gregor? The mountain zombie. That's how light works. What played, is he, Franken Mountain? That man played a little offensive line in his day. <laughs> He's scary. I'm so sorry. That is terrifying. Get out of my way. King's orders, Your Grace. He would like you to remain in the Red Keep for your own protection. You're barring me from attending my own daughter's funeral. Forgive me, Your Grace, by the King's command, I cannot let you pass. I would like to speak to my son. He has left the Red Keep, Your Grace. Really? That would make me so mad to my core if like, one of my kids commanded something like that of me to like lock me in my room. Well, he's irritated because she he locked her wife up. His wife up. She grew up. Almost. If we caught Prince Tristane's killers, expect it was mother. Your mother wouldn't do that. Yes, she would. Oh, man. Are you angry with her? Of course not. Then why didn't you let her come? She has every right to be here. He told me she wouldn't be allowed in the sept. If she had tried. I'm not putting your mother in a cell ever again. Not while I'm here. Okay, Jamie. Thank goodness. Why haven't you gone to see her? Everything she endured, she did it for you. Oh, don't you think I know that? We're Tommen, though. I'm sorry. When the faith militant seized her and Marjorie, what did I do? Oh, he's ashamed. They paraded her through the mm. streets like a whore. What did I do? We all fail sometimes. If I can't even protect my own wife or my own mother, what good am I? I want to see my wife. The gods wait for Queen Marjorie to confess her crimes and seek their mercy. The king must wait as well. Go and see your mother, Tommen. That poor kid. Let's go, Jamie. You're a bold man. On the contrary, I fear a great deal. Hmm, <laughs> what's he talking about? You know why? We use these stones to remind us not to fear death. We close our eyes on this world and open them on the next. You imprisoned and humiliated my sister. Your sister sought the gods' mercy and atoned for her sin. What about my sins? I broke a sacred oath and stabbed my king in the back. I killed my own cousin. When the gods judged my brother guilty, I helped them escape that justice. What atonement do I deserve? Yeah, ask him, Jamie. You would spill blood in this holy place. Well, the gods won't mind. They spill more blood than the rest of us combined. I deserve it. We all do. We are weak, vain creatures. We live only by the mother's mercy. They came in at the right time, didn't they? All synchronized. They should be closer if you mean for them to save you. I don't. They'd never reach me before you struck. I fought against worse odds. No doubt many of us would fall. But who are we? We have no names, no family. Every one of us is poor and powerless. And yet together, we can overthrow an empire. They're like the Night's Watch, but like the God's Watch. Yeah, something like that. Well, it's just annoying because they're not like a religious church. They're not that at all. They're a cult, like a far out cult. So it's just annoying. Like the same way that like if you kill all the masters and make everyone part of your army in a way, like you're the master the same way. Mm -hmm. Like he's committing sin because he's locking people up and torturing them. Like you can't do that, bro. Jamie's going to have to teach him though. Did they put her in the red gown or the gold? Gold. Was it with her color? That is what the lady said, the gold. I'm sorry. They're gonna be buried in gold, I'm right? you here. I didn't want to lose you again. I understand. I'm glad to see you. I know I should have come sooner. I wanted to. I was wrong. I should have executed all of them. I should have pulled down the sept onto the high sparrow's head before I let them do that to you. Oh well, yeah, bro. She would have, for me. Aww. Um. You raised me to be strong. I wasn't, but I want to be. Help me. Uh oh. Well, it's not even like he has to do it. He just has to give the order. Just give the order. Yeah. Drag him out. But he's just a young kid. Well, hopefully he doesn't take all that and then become like overzealous, like a tyrant. Or be like Joffrey. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> if 
I lost my cock, I drink all the time. Why keep doing him like that? Oh, angry worm. Meaning no offense. Yeah, he's gonna have to stop making that joke around here. Dwarf jokes. I make eunuch jokes. I do not make dwarf jokes. You think them? <laughs> so the fleet has been burned. Surely there's some good news lurking somewhere. Astapor and Yonkai have stopped asking us for aid. Perhaps they can tell us the secret. The masters have retaken both cities. That keeps happening pretty fast. What about the dragons? We have the two of them here, beneath the pyramid. They haven't touched any food since Queen Daenerys left. Daenerys is the dragon queen. Can't very well let the dragons starve. Dragons do not do well in captivity. How do you know this? That's what I do. I drink and I know things. <laughs> <laughs> The He's a clever little Aegon devil. <laughs> used to conquer Westeros, then Daenerys' ancestors started chaining them up in pens. A few generations later, the last dragons were no larger than cats. <laughs> must That'd be, be so cute. That's crazy. They domesticated the mess out of them. Day, how many times were you in the company of these dragons? Many times. And did they ever harm you? Never. Dragons are intelligent, more intelligent than men, according to some maesters. They have affection for their friends and fury for their enemies. I am their friend. Do they know that? They will. It's time they had their supper. Oh, no. He's really about to go try that? <laughs> I really hope he doesn't go deliver it, though, because I'm not trying to be rude, but he's kind of bite-sized. Oh, come on, Darian. You got this. What has he got to feed him? A torch? <laughs> <laughs> is there a marshmallow on it? <laughs> the Daenerys is like inflammable but him yeah something bad's bound to happen to him he's got all kinds of stuff going on you can't weasel your way to freedom in there <laughs> oh i wonder why it didn't well they're intelligent they probably thought to themselves it was like they're, bring us food. they're like oh you drink and know things okay that's what's up do you know how to get out of here you know where my I'm mom's up with your mother yeah that dead meat abandoned us I'm here to help. Don't eat the help. <laughs> <laughs> when I was a child, an uncle asked what gift I wanted for my name day. I begged him for one of you. It wouldn't even have to be a big dragon, I told him. It could be little, like me. Aww. He's just talking to them, though, and they're chilling. Everyone laughed like it was the funniest thing they'd ever heard. And my father told me the last dragon had died a century ago. I cried myself to sleep that night. He's risking it all. Dang, he didn't even have to wiggle the pen or nothing. I mean, no fellas, y'all ever done that before? I'll just yank the pen out. He said, here, here's mine. <laughs> didn't he? He like, help, he like showed him. They're intelligent. So he he said, go ahead. He said, come on over here, brother. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pen man, brother. You better wiggle it. <laughs> He's like, this stupid motherfucker. <laughs> About to eat you, motherfucker. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> the language. Sorry for cussing. This Game of Thrones. Next time I have an idea like that, punch me in the face. <laughs> <laughs> no, you did a great job. That was the bravest thing I've ever seen. I thought he was about to lose another one. I know. I couldn't do it. I wonder why they let him. For real. I know you said intelligent, but still. What's your name? No one. I don't believe that. Oh. You don't believe that. <laughs> Dang. So she uses the daily butt woven by her. Who are you? Oh, that's your boy. No one. If a girl says her name, a man will let her sleep under a roof tonight. A girl has no name. If a girl says her name, a man will feed her tonight. A girl has no name. Are we trying to tempt her? Mm -hmm. If a girl says her name, a man will give her eyes back. Oh, yeah. A girl has no name. Oh, so she's. Valor de Hara sing right now. She really wants to be in this club, don't she? Mm hmm She wants to go get them revenge kills. Oh, she got promoted? We came upon the bodies on our way here. Half a dozen men, your best hunters. They obviously had help. I didn't think Lady Sansa killed them all by herself. Yes, she did. Thank you for this report, Lord Karstark. We know where she's going. Stark. Her brother's at Castle Black. Ned Stark's last surviving son. Jon Snow's a bastard, not a Stark. So is I. Your hold on the North will never be secure as long as a Stark can walk through that door. Castle Black isn't defended on the southern side. The few men left are barely men at all. Farm boys and thieves. I could storm the castle, kill Jon Snow. Murder the Lord Commander of the Night's Watch. They don't know. You'd unite every house on the North against us. We don't need 
every house in the north. The Umbers, the Mandalists, and the Karstarks command more soldiers than all the other houses combined. With their support, none could challenge. The Starks lost my house the day King Rob cut off my father's head. It's time for new blood in the north. There is his own. I see how that decision, though, is really, really playing out long term. <laughs> right, he said he was going to haunt him. He was serious. Right. If you acquire a reputation as a mad dog, you'll be treated as a mad dog, taken out back and slaughtered for pig feed. My lords. Lady Walder has given birth. That was fast. And it was a boy. Red and healthy. Red Cheek. Congratulations, Lord Bolton. What a day for you, Roos. Congratulations, father. I look forward to meeting my new brother. You'll always be my firstborn. Right. Thank you for saying He has the, like, the, the document. He's a great deal. He's good. <laughs> what? Dude. I thought he killed Ramsey. I thought so too. Oh my god, that was just bro. I thought he just killed Ramsey. Oh, you are no way. He just did exactly what he did to Rob Sart. Dang, that was nuts, dude. The way they executed that, it really, it really felt like. Oh man. Dang Rams. Mr. Walken, send ravens to all the northern houses. Bruce Bolton is dead, poisoned by our enemies. That guy's like, but that's like a lie. I've seen what happened. How did he die? Yeah, Reek. How did he die? Poisoned by his enemies. You're talking to your lord. Use respect. Oh. Forgive me, my lord. Send for Lady Walda and the baby. Oh, but if she, if he kills them, then then that's the phrase like against them, though, right? Dang. Yeah, but why not just run out there and be like, oh my God, Ramsey just murdered his dad because he just had a baby boy. Ring the alarm. Oh no. There he is. Isn't he wonderful? He is. May I hold him? Of course. Little brother. Lord Bolton sent for us. Have you seen him? Oh, he's seen him. He sure has. Follow me, mother. Oh, no. That poor girl, though, because she just, she got sold off to this. <gasps> no. Oh, that's where the dogs are. Where is Lord Bolton? It's cold out here, Ramsey. I need to feed him. Where is your father? Ramsey. I just hate it, man, because she walked right into it. There was literally nothing she could do. Where is Lord Bolton? Hopefully this is like just a flex, right? Nah. I am Lord Bolton. <gasps> she knows, man. Ramsay, I'll leave Winterfell. I'll go back to the Riverlands. Please, he's your brother. I prefer being an only child. <laughs> you oh cold. my gosh. You colder than Winterfell, Ramsay. <laughs> For a second, he almost looked like he felt bad about it. Never. You don't know which way she went. I spent three days looking for her. She disappeared. Oh, Arya. How'd she look? She looked good. She wasn't exactly dressed like a lady. <laughs> no, she wouldn't be. What happened at Winterfell? Uh-oh. I should have gone with you while I had the chance. It was a difficult choice, my lady. We've all had to make difficult choices. Come on, Padrick. Rope's not burning. We shouldn't be lighting fires. He won't stop hunting us. We just have to make it to Castle Black. Once we're with John Ramsay, he won't be able to touch us. John will have me killed the moment I step through the gate. I'll tell him the truth about Bran and Rickon. And the truth about the farm boys I killed in their place. And the truth about Sir Roderick, who I beheaded. And the truth about Rob, who I betray. When you take the black, all your crimes are forgiven. I don't want to be forgiven. I never make amends to your family for the things I've done. They'll keep you safer than I ever could. You're not coming with us? I would have taken you all the way to the wall. I would have died to get you there. But where's he going? Why? May I take one of the horses? I'm like, hell no. You invaded Winterfell. Where are you going? <laughs> Home. He's going back to like his family? Oh, your dad is like grumpy. <laughs> the ironborn who held it? They died fighting to a man. His dead may never die. But his dead may never die. But they did. And our invasion died with them. Deepwood Mott was our last stronghold on the mainland. Then we will take more. We can defeat anyone at sea, but we'll never hold lands and castles against mainland armies. Not if our captains defy my orders, abandon their posts, and sacrifice our men on foolish missions. I won't apologize for trying to rescue Theon. Then where is he? Where is your kingdom? Hey. We took those castles because the Northerners marched off to war. Uh, that war is over. Yeah, they home. I watched from that window as they breached our walls and knocked down our towers. I lost two brothers that day. And I lost three sons. The war of the five kings, they call it, when the other four are dead. When you rule the Iron Islands, you can wage all the peace you want. But for now, shut your mouth on a bay or I will make another heir. Who will? You old for that, Skipper. He's not listening, though. He's the only one of the five kings alive, though. He's right. He must be doing something right by minding his own business until he passed this crusty bridge. <laughs> oh, 
Pass, fool, move aside for your king. Haven't I always, brother? Brother? That's, what am I missing? Who's this dude? I thought you'd be rotting under some foreign sea by now. What is dead may never die. Has the custom changed since I've been gone? Aren't you supposed to repeat the words? Could mock our god without my help. I don't mock the drowned god. I am the drowned god. From Old Town to Kaf, when men see my sails, they pray. Can y'all talk in the castle? You're old, brother. You have had your time. That's his now brother? That another... I heard you lost your mind during a storm on the Jade Sea. Tied you to the mast to keep you from jumping overboard. They did. When the storm passed, you cut out their tongue. I needed silence. What kind of an ironborn loses his senses during a storm? I am the storm, brother. The first storm and the last. And you're in my way. So he's about to kill him, huh? Loki. Yep. Oh, that's the last of the five kings. And this is his brother? I, I don't... I don't know this guy. He like, what is dead may never die him. Lord, take your servant Balon back beneath the waves. Feed the creatures of your kingdom on his flesh. Pull his bones down to your depths to rest beside his ancestors and his children. Dead, Isn't it kind of cool to see all their funeral traditions though in different places? Right. Even though it sucks, people die. Except for him, I don't really like hear. Well, no offense. Yeah, he kind of sucks. Find out who did this. I'm going to feed them to the sharks while they live. I swear it by the salt throne. The salt throne is not yours to swear upon. My father would have wanted me to rule. Your father does not get to choose. The law is clear. Perhaps you'll be the first woman in history to rule the Ironborn. And perhaps not. Oh, it's a vote? Yeah, maybe a vote. But it's going to be her against that dude who just killed him, the brother. Right, That's what I'm because he just popped up in out of nowhere. Maybe that will be like the storyline. Because forward. she's not the first one. She's a woman. Like they, they said they've never voted over one. Nah, but she's catfishing, though. Yeah, she is hard. Sorry, my lady. Didn't mean to interrupt. You interrupt nothing. I assume you know why I'm here. It's about the Lord Commander. Former Lord Commander. Does he have to be? What are you asking? Do you know of any magic that could help him? Bring him back. Talking about John? Help him. Leave him be. Can it be done? I met a man who came back from the dead, but the priest who did it, it shouldn't have been possible. But it was. It was we met them. It could be. No. Yeah, the guy that was fighting with the eye patch. Mm -hmm. Not for you. I saw you drink poison. That should have killed you. I saw you give birth to a demon made of shadows. Everything I believed. The great victory I saw in the flames. All of it was a lie. Dang. You were right all along. The Lord never spoke to me. Her faith is shattered. Oh, fuck them then. Fuck all of them. I'm not a devout man. Obviously. I'm not asking the Lord a light for help. I'm asking the woman who showed me that miracles exist. I never had this gift. Have you ever tried? She's like, why would I really? So she's about to try to bring this man back to life. That's crazy. If she does this, she might be like the best red priestess. If he comes back, he would be like 50 cent, right? Nah, a little tougher than 50 cent. Well, I don't know. Yeah, 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 about the same. He got shot, what, nine times? So she has to restyle him? If she does revive him, is he even going to be himself? I don't know. Maybe he'll be like a Frankenstein or something. Like the mountain? Yeah. And gear persis. And more hot. This is giving me some supernatural vibes right here. I'm so scared that it's not going to work. That'd be so anticlimactic. I know. Why show all this if it doesn't work? Please. Disappointed. <gasps> Back alive. Oh. And he looked like he was alive too. Like not like a white. Oh man. So he's back. We're back in the game, bro. All right, guys. What an incredible way to start out the season. Like, geez, babe, what do you think about these? They, there's like two shocking, well, a lot of shocking things, but two that stick out in my mind, and that was Roost dying and Jon Snow coming back to life. That was a lot of shocking moments. So we started out. So, okay, so where are we at on this show? So I thought Cersei would be devastated with the death of her daughter, and obviously she was, but I thought it was going to be more of like fire towards Jamie. But like I was saying in the episode, I feel like all these experience she's had has led her to she's like different now she's yeah. more i don't know man she's thinking bigger picture i don't really know we'll, we'll, we'll come to that but she doesn't even like have she's not doing anything she's not giving anything right now right it's kind of hard to tell it's almost like like she's catatonic in a way still yeah she just right. experienced a lot and she's just chilling it seems right uh your girl daenerys sort of got caught up with some dorthraki um over in essos 
They captured her, wrote her down. She left a little sign for Jorah and company. And Daenerys went over there and basically handled, her, handled herself just like you would expect Daenerys to handle herself. She said that she's the queen of all the titles, titles, titles. And they recognized her title and they said that you're going to live out your days in the old folks home, basically in the yeah. retirement home. So so we have not got to see that part yet. You know, I don't think the Dragon Queen is meant to be caged up like that. No. So we'll see how that goes. She's something, definitely escaping. <laughs> something she's tells me she'll burn it down before she gets stuck right. there. 100%. She's definitely escaping. Um, Tyrion also got to meet the dragons well, and he freed them and they didn't even burn him, which was like crazy because I genuinely thought that they would. I thought they would eat him up like a pig in a blanket yeah, for real. I thought they would have gobbled him up real quick. Right. And they were hungry, but apparently they're extremely intelligent. I didn't realize they were so smart. Right. But Tyrion so drinks and those things. They so. somehow have a respect for him, which was strange to see. Um, Sansa and Theon snuck away and and Brienne luckily came in and saved the day, which was like That the part was best, awesome. That was the best, best scene yes, for sure. The, the best, best scene. But then um, Theon's kind of going back to his place, which is also under chaos. Yeah. The new generation is now taking over in the Greyjoys world. Right. And some dude showed up on a bridge and killed their dad, man, which is insane. And apparently that's his brother because he was like, you look old, brother. Yeah. I don't know if it was like. So he's more like, of like here, but there's they said they vote. So. Obviously, he's going to be the other one that, that Yara is going to go against, I guess. They must not know that guy's in town yet or something. I don't know. but He wasn't even at the funeral. Well, he did it. So I don't know why he would be. I mean, I'd like to see her in charge, right? 100%. Yeah. And it, it seems like they have the respect for her. So yeah, she's, you would think I've, she'd be the easy choice, but they said no women have done it before. So. Well, I've seen her lead men, so yeah. why not? Why not? Um, Give her a chance. Love that part of the storyline. Oh, Brent. yeah. And Dorn. And Dorn. Um, Alaria, the ties there too, guys. Yeah, which is like I don't know how she can just like take over. She kills him. I don't know how you just take over, but I guess that's how you do it. Yeah, you just murder the sitting king, and you just really hope the next person don't come behind and murder you because yeah. if they do, nobody's gonna care because that's just a precedent that you set. So um, that part is kind of crazy. I don't know. I don't know how that's gonna end up. I'm really hoping that we see a showdown between her and Cersei because that's sort of yeah, where the show seems to be I think that's going. where it's going. I think right. she's gonna build up the Dornish army to go take on King's Landing. Yeah. Oh, and yeah, then 100%. and then the new well, obviously Bruce Bolton died, but Ramsey, it seems like he's gotten the North like on his side because the Car Stark guy was there. So the only thing is, if they find out the truth, the phrase won't be on their side, which yeah. would. I don't know if that, but according to Ramsey, they don't even need all that. They got the numbers and he's got everything figured out. And as long as his dogs are fed, he's happy. So, um, yeah, that this bro. is this is getting crazy. Like, yeah. there's a lot going on. Um, wow, season six has been insane. Like, I'm loving this. Well, obviously, the big thing that happened in this episode was John came back and oh, they used yeah. magic and to do it. So, like, my mind sh went straight to like the supernatural. So, like in my mind, dude, like you bring John back from the dead. Well, he brought demons with him, baby. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like he like doesn't what, get to just come back. Right. Is he, he something's something's gonna be up with him? Like the Frankenstein effect or something. Right. So maybe John will come back and you know how John's just been so honorable. The best. He, maybe he'll come back darker. Right. You or, know what I'm saying? Yeah. Or like, what if he gets a flaming sword because he can come back like that one guy? What if you know how he needed that other guy to revive him? What if Melisandre is like his reviver? What if Melisandre gets in his head like Stannis oh, and he no. takes over the army? No, 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 no. She I have no idea. Be. This could go anywhere, you guys, but it seems like. Oh, and Mel then she's very old. Like, yeah, she's like an old she's ancient old lady. lady. Yeah. Oh, wow. So like when she saw the war coming, she they must have like sent her from like years behind. Right. Doesn't yeah. it seem like it she's like It seems like she's there? been, it's almost like, yeah, the whole show is giving me the idea that everything's sort of predetermined and right. they're all playing out like a prophecy. And she's right. one of those characters who's put there to make sure everything goes according to plan, but then she questions her own like role right. and everything. Because she thought it was Stannis. She like put everything into Stannis. And then when she found out it wasn't Stannis, she automatically retreated. It's going to be one of those things where it turns out all along, like you were only supposed to think it was Stannis, but that's actually what you're supposed to think to put you on the right path of the Lord of the Light and all that. So right. 100%, I can Maybe see how that Maybe the Lord of the Light is like so important. Right. 
I like uh, Sir Davos. He really held up for John yeah. out there. Like that was pretty. cool. I really like that too. I like how in this world, like at any moment, like if if the right if the right cause comes along, like you're just down to die for it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like I really like that in a sense. That's why I said I need me some friends like that because mm-hmm. you would hope your friends would have your back, right? In that way, you know what I'm saying? Um, guys, I just can't believe they killed John, and I can't believe they brought him back, and especially with magic. I'm really excited to see how that plays out. Right. But at the same time, a lot of people. I mean, let's be real. We're not, is this the point of the series where a lot of people were saying they don't like it? Well, I heard season six was amazing, so I so don't know. Season seven people hate? I don't know. I don't. Let I us don't know. know. I haven't hated any of it. But to be honest, I'm not really smart enough to realize. So, insane episode, guys. We are literally getting there, and then obviously we're going to hop on House of Dragons and but the plan. But hey, while we're with the High Sparrow, I forgot that Marjorie and Loris, like, how are they going to get out? They're not. They're going to rot in that cell. They don't have a trial? Well, maybe the tough King Tommen can get some. Oh, you know, yeah. And King Tommen kind of said, hey, Cersei, help me out. And that's, like, dangerous. Because Cersei, you know, Cersei just got screwed over by, like, King's Landing. So she really doesn't like them. Like, I'm, it could go really bad for them. You know, I could see something happening where Cersei and uh, Sir Gregor Clegane and the king. And, you know, the king doesn't really have too much of a say. He sort of, like, concedes power to his mother and she takes it over. I could see her doing this thing where she like wages war and they end up taking her some type of like hostage. Speaking of Marjorie, mm-hmm. and so she's like, "Who cares? Chop her head off. No one cares." You know what I'm saying? And then she Tommen hates her anyways. On, and then Tommen turns on Cersei. And then Tommen just yeah. I don't know what Tommen does, but I don't know. That's what's so interesting about the show because with King Tommen, so much of the emphasis of who the king is of the Andals and the First Men, so much of that has been taken off because. King Tom is not really that guy. So yeah. they used to mean a lot more at the beginning of the yeah, show. And now everyone else seems to matter more. And so it's yeah. very weird how it turned full circle like that. So I guess, I guess if, I guess like with King Tommen, like he can't really do anything, but the only thing that could happen is either there's that trial or Marjorie just has to confess and do the street thing. If she confesses and does that little street thing, then she's good. Maybe uh, it's worse. But like, I don't know. Like if Cersei confesses and, in three weeks and then you know it takes marjorie three months does she get a worse crime right like a worse punishment i don't know that's that's like a whole thing like i guess we'll have to see play out i mean the more you sit there and deny their charges i mean that's just more crime right you're just doing it day in and day out but i guess like i don't i don't know this show is getting like (laughs) this show is insane yeah thank you patreon for voting for it i love it so much i can't wait to watch the rest of the season what else? I mean, what else is going on? Is there anything else that we're missing? I'm sure. I mean, obviously, there's so much that we're missing. But oh, I mean, other than the fact that Jorah like is about to like, hopefully oh, he they ca- cut his arm off. Well, he kind of confessed his love for Cersei, like in a, in a way Daenerys? where yeah, Daenerys. He sort of confessed his love for Daenerys in a way that I don't know if he's came out and really no. said it like that, but he really it's said been it. Implied today. hard though. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's pretty obvious, right? Yeah, it's um, not implied, but yeah, I guess today was the day where he decided, hey, I'm just gonna let everyone know I actually love her. Somehow, somehow, another man, Daenerys, is going to get charge of this Dorthraki army. I don't know if she's going to do it through marriage this time, obviously. Uh, I don't think you can or something like that. That's what the guy was saying. It's forbidden to like sleep with a former cow's wife. So she can't do it through marriage, but maybe through dragon. But she's going to she's gonna have her another, another so? army. I really think so. I mean, either yeah, that I or mean, she's about to get completely distracted trying to like go to war with those dudes or she's gonna get completely like just like tormented in this house of widows or whatever yeah they're gonna be talking about like old tv shows and <laughs> old issues in the marriage that or what if, what if it what if it just makes her fall into like a place of depression and she doesn't leave it <laughs> just whittles away out there I have no idea. Guys, thank you so much for tuning in. We need to we need to watch some more of this so we can get some more to talk about. 